Okay. I just got out of the shower, and I didn't do anything with my hair, because I wanted to infuriate you. But what, what happened was I got out of the shower, and I looked at the mirror, and I looked at my skin, and there was water glistening on my chest. And I thought of the word glistening, glisten, because I thought it, it's kind of shining, but we built a, whole, a word. An entire, we, we created an entire word to explain the, the phenomena that exists when water is reflecting quickly on a surface because of movement or angular perceptive movement. Angular movement, perceptive movement. And we call it glistening. And then I thought, we, that's what we do. We, we, we see things and we describe them with new words that make sense of what they were. I looked on the tiles on the wall in the, in the, in the mirror, in the shower, and I thought cross-angulation, which was cre creating a crossing to create four angles in a situation. Cross-angulation, perhaps crossing yourself to create four angles in a situation if there's four people. And that would be the action of crossing to create angles. Cross-angulation. And now it, it makes, the way we set up the language structure, we can build that and it makes logistic sense. And we just keep expanding. And then we have, we gather all these ideas into this one idea, and then all these ideas into this one idea. And we use those ideas to see this new idea that we give a name to and repeat and repeat and we're constantly getting ideas for everything, but it's almost like we're building a pyramid of ideas up to the idea, which people call God or it, the vibration. So it seems like a pyramid, but maybe, you know, maybe there'll be several layers up there, and then that will go up to another layer where there's more layers, and then ultimately maybe we'll get to a point where it's thought equals action. We can simulate it. There's computer simulations now with, I'll, I'll put the link on the thing. Swen sent it to me. It's about a helmet that allows us to use our mind and our thoughts to affect the game or the system, the computer system. When thought equals action, maybe that's the tip of the pyramid. Maybe that means we built the pyramid. Because they built the pyramid. And we can build a pyramid of thought. And then we'll, thought equals action, we, that will become another layer. Oh boy. Somehow, I think. Fun shower facts. <laughs> See you, dude.